When the season started, there seemed to be a few chances for the team to break the streak with the game against Independence being the most heartbreaking for the team. But last night at Kirkendall Stadium, it was a celebration more than a thousand days in the making. The team came right out of the gate with Caleb Cooper scoring a 70-yard touchdown on the first play of the game. Memorial would follow up with the touchdown to tie the game 7-7 heading into the second quarter. The second quarter would be sloppy with turnovers galore for both teams and the game would stay tied heading into the half. The second half, however, would be all Liberty. Daniel Essien would open up the floodgates, scoring on a 46-yard rushing touchdown. Declan Hurley would force a fumble on a huge memorial play, and Seth Graff would recover the fumble in their own end zone for a touchback. The Redhawks would score on their next drive with the Patrick Rowe 14-yard reception. The team scored again with around two minutes to go with the Landon Regatta's rushing touchdown to take the lead 28-7. Reed Somers would put the final nail in the coffin with an interception in the end zone with four seconds to go. And Kai Bunting would kneel the ball to give the Redhawks their first win since 2021. The biggest difference in the game, Memorial's five turnovers. And for the first time in years, all the breaks seemed to go the Redhawks' way.